With these concepts in mind, it's time to dive into the actual ML Agents workflow. This workflow can be broken into three high-level steps. Creating our environment, training the brains in that environment, and then embedding those trained brains back into the Unity scene. We'll walk through each of these in order. To start with, we want to create our environment. In a little bit, we'll show you exactly what that looks like in the editor and in the code, but right now I want to walk through what the conceptually looks like at the level of ML agents. In ML agents, we introduce three new concepts, the agent, the brain, and the academy. At the lowest level, the academy is what allows everything to work together, and it's what allows Unity to communicate with outside training frameworks like TensorFlow using our Python API. At one level up from that, we have the brain. The brains are what actually make decisions, and these can be thought of as our neural networks. Now, with these brains, we need things to actually take these decisions and act on them in the world, and these are our agents. Each agent observes the world at any given step of the simulation and uses that observation via the brain to take actions in the world. What you can see here is a relatively simple diagram where we have two agents being controlled by a single brain. We can make this more complex, as seen in this diagram here, where we now have four different kinds of brains, each controlling multiple different agents. You can imagine an African Sahara where you have different kinds of animals, for example, elephants, lions, and zebras. Each of these kinds of animals would correspond to a different brain, which is a different way of taking actions, the way in which an elephant might, a lion might, or a zebra might. Then we have the actual agents themselves, which correspond to the actually living animals, of which there may be many. Now that we've shown you what this looks like at the conceptual level, let's jump into the Unity Editor itself and see what it looks like there.